you're back. All right, everybody, my uh, first guest is the star of the ABC series Hope and Faith and the co-host of Live with Regis and Kelly. Please welcome the lovely and, I believe, very sexy Kelly Ripa. <laughs> I'm not being nice. I'm just telling no, it like it is. Very You're a kind. sexy, sexy woman. Well, <laughs> I tried to look nice for you tonight. Well, I thank you very much. I curled my hair and put on my best lipstick. Very nice. You look thank fantastic. You. Thank you thank for being you. here. You can tell that you're a new father. You haven't gotten much sleep. You, you know what? The... I'm not getting a ton of sleep, but <laughs> yeah. uh, I, I drink a lot of coffee before the show. Oh, and, good. Uh, yeah. And uh, no, I, I've been I've been doing fine actually. My wife does most of the work. Yeah, right. She does yeah. all the heavy lifting. Yeah, she does. And I'm like, I'd like to help, but I need my sleepy pie. <laughs> I would say America needs me to be pretty. <laughs> You're lucky you don't have a morning show, because I, you know, That's with tough. the kids at home, they're up all night. You still got to get up and do the morning show. Yeah, but Reg wakes you up when he starts yelling at you. Second That's, That's true. the thing about Reg is, is I'm, the times that I've been a guest on that show, I show up, I'm dead tired. Yes. You're, it's always, you know, they shoot it early in the morning. You right. try and wake up, and then Reg just comes to the dress and goes, "Hey, how are you? Yeah. What's going on?" Yeah, it's amazing. And it's like getting standing behind a jet right. when it starts. You just get yeah. hit in the face. With hey, O'Brien. How are you? We gotta go, and we're gonna do this, and we're gonna do yeah. that, and then we're gonna go this way, and we're gonna get on a bicycle, and we're gonna ride over here. Have, we had uh, Ben Affleck on the show today, and Ben Name does... Name dropper? No, no, no. He does this thing... <laughs> He does this incredible Regis impersonation. Mm -hmm. And so to have the two of them sort of, because Ben does Regis and then Regis tries to outdo Regis to Ben. Right. And, they, and it was literally five minutes of shouting at the top, where I said nothing and just watched two men shout at each other. You can't. I'm Regis, I'm out of control. No, I'm not, I am, I'm out of control. That's the thing is you can't out, you can't, there's no such thing as exaggerating a Regis impression. Right. There's, no, there's like, nowhere else there's to go. There's no ceiling. There's no ceiling. <laughs> Now, speaking of Reg, as I call him, uh, yeah. no, you and Regis have pet names for each other, is we that right? We do, that's right. What is your pet name for Regis? I call him Big Daddy. He's my big, he's my big oh my daddy. God. That is disgusting. <laughs> it's creepy. It's, it's very creepy. It Hi, all... Big Daddy. How are you, pussycat? <laughs> it all started, like, you know, when I first, when I first got the I job. I don't want to know how that name started. No, no. When I first got the job, he couldn't remember my name. He would only what? call me... You're Ka his co-host. Well, he would call me Kathy Lee because he was very used to saying Kathy Lee. And so he... It, it, so if he called me... That's he, absurd. <laughs> he just... Kelly, he, he couldn't, Kathy Lee... He couldn't change. Right. Yeah, exactly. I get it. I totally get it. Right. So, um... So then he started calling me uh, Pippa because as when he had when his daughters were small he would read to them the story Pippa the mouse, and so he said I reminded him of that mouse and Rippa sort of sounds like Pippa so it was Pippa and that's what he remind you know that's, that's all the he stupidest could... thing I've ever heard. <laughs> well, you like Pippa? She's a little mouse. Okay, really. <laughs> Forget Poor. the fact that everywhere it says live with Regis and Kelly. And, like, if he forgot, he could just look up at the wall. He could have you wear a hat that said your, <laughs> your name right. on it. For... But it's Pippa, and so he calls me Pippa. So one day I just said to him, um, I just said, well, you know, I, I just started talking baby talk to him. I don't know why. For lack of something better to do. And, and That's I what said, we all want to do to Regis is talk <laughs> to him said, like a baby. <laughs> and I said, oh, you're my big man. You're my big daddy. Oh, my God. And it, it's so... <laughs> It's... That just turned me on. <laughs> it didn't. It, it's so... I'll pretend I'm Regis again. <laughs> Who is my big guy? Oh, you yes. are, yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> But he, like, he was so repulsed by it. He was repulsed by he it. That repulsed... is the eh, wrong reaction, Regis. <laughs> repulsed by it. Well, now he's, like, doubly repulsed, because everywhere he goes, everybody calls him Big Daddy. Like, right. people very rarely... I mean, they'll occasionally call me Pippa. Right. But for the most part... Universally, everyone in America calls him Big Daddy. So if he goes to McDonald's and wants uh, hey, some French fries... Hey, Big Daddy, fry. want some big fries? Oh, you wow. want some, you know, a so you McLarge, Big you, Daddy? You turned his life into a living hell. Yeah, right. Good for you. Now... Uh, I do what I can. You get a lot of mail from viewers mm -hmm. who, have, who demand that you get a manicure. Yeah! Why is that? Isn't that, that weird? Well, I don't know. So much of the show is... It's stuff that we hold up in host chat, we have like a little desk like you have, and we hold up things that people send in to us, or... Um, so you like, if you're holding up... Uh... Like, if I'm holding up, like, my note cards. If right. I'm holding them up, they'll see my hands. And I, I did get a manicure because I was doing your show, but not right. for my own. Um, but typically, I'm like a... You know, I, I pick at my cuticles, I sort of chew on my nails, I yeah. don't really fuss around with 
manicure things. We now. actually I have just... footage. I think this is from the show just the other day. I, I think I know what you're talking about. Take a look at this. It's pretty. Uh, <laughs> yeah. No, it's true. Nelly Furtado. <laughs> you're really a disgusting person. Apparently, yeah, you operate a, really, a garage in the morning. There's a really, there's a, that's right. I was working <laughs> yeah. on my taxi, <laughs> right. and then I came to work. Yeah, so no. I get a lot, you'd be surprised, because what happens is we ask people to fax in. Um, you know, if you have a question or a comment, please fax us during the show. Right. Which is really inviting all kinds of trouble, because very rarely will people fax in to say anything nice. They usually fax in because it's a passive-aggressive thing to do, and, like, you can say whatever you want. Nobody knows it's you. Right, right. <laughs> And so if I if I sh if my if my hand comes up you hear the fax machine going gee, gee, gee. and it's either people who own nail salons who want me to come in for a free manicure right or it's people saying please either you know remove her hands or don't let the, her show them on the air because I'm having my breakfast that was me actually I, I sent that one in <laughs> just that way isn't that mean that's terrible See, look how the audience feels bad for me they just feel bad in general um, <laughs> Now, Regis likes to make you sing. Is that he, right? Well, he, like, he likes Gelman, to try... Gelman likes to make me sing. Because, like I said, Regis and Kathy Lee... Um, they Kathy would Lee, sing. at the drop of a hat, would sing. They would, well, they would sing together. They had... Um, they, first, they had, like, an act that they did, like, a, like, oh, a, yeah. like a, an act at the casinos that they would do. Right. But then every Christmas, they would do a Christmas special, and they would sing. And so they kept saying, do you sing? And I would say, no. Well, you must sing something. Oh, no, no, I don't. I'm a terrible singer. Well, we're going to have you sing anyway, and it'll be great because you'll sing, and Regis will sing, and you'll sing. Right. And so they had us rehearse, and and lo and behold, I was horrible, and they couldn't. They thought I was just being self-deprecating. Oh, you're just being self-deprecating. But you really can't sing. Really can't sing. Totally tone deaf. So I'm singing on the show, and now it's become this thing where if I'm not good, if I don't behave myself, they make me sing. And so every year, the Christmas special, they make me sing. And last year, they played this horrible joke. They told me that they got me a, a pitch correction device where I could sing as poorly as I wanted to, and it would make me sound fine. It would Which I've heard of the pitch correction machine. You they use it on a lot of pop stars to the, put them uh, in perfect pitch. The elusive pitch correction machine. Well, they totally didn't do that. They just told me that. So I'm just singing Winter Wonderland with reckless tone-deaf abandon. Right, You right. know, because I'm like, they're going to fix this in the edit. Right. Well, so you were like, walking in a winter wonderland. <laughs> that was actually very good. Gelman, I don't think the pitch correction machine was on. And he said, you fool. There's no pitch correction machine. You would think we would spend the money on that for this? What kind of producer's I... like, you fool? <laughs> I've never heard of that. <laughs> <laughs> fool. I made you look like an ass. No, See you tomorrow. Like what is that? Well, now it's become like a, it's become a real ratings grabber. People are like, watch, tune in for Kelly's poor singing. Uh, before we go, you have a hunkiest husband calendar right That's now. Let's see right. the Regis Let's Mr. November. Yes, Do we have yes. that right now? There we go. No. Look at that. Look at that. Hey. That's fine. Look at those breasts, folks. Yeah, he's got some man he's boobies on him right there. <laughs> You tell him I said so. Uh -huh. I guess Christmas came early. All, right. all the proceeds go to charity. All the proceeds for, go to charity. For our calendar. I hope That's so, right. yeah. <laughs> I'm going to profit from this myself by showing my new torso. Um, all right, he had uh, his way with that, Kirby. Yes. Uh, oh, my God. I didn't mean it that way. <laughs> How fast they turned. Yeah, oh, his crowd is like, with you, like, and then they're not. It was like the Saddam Hussein Exactly. Joke. Uh, Check your local listings for Live with Regis and Kelly. Yes. Hope and Faith airs Friday nights at 9 on ABC. Yeah, Kelly, thank, thank you. you so much for being and here. And take care of that baby. I will do that. Bye-bye. Thank you so much. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. Kelly Rippa, we'll be right back. Emma Bolger, stick around.